Hey Aquarius, welcome to my channel. Uh, this will be a reading for the 29th of November to the 5th of December. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading, so it may not resonate for everybody. So please take what does and leave what doesn't. And if you like the reading, please like, share and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate that. Okay, let's look at the overall card for you guys. An overall picture. What's been going on? Ooh. We have the two of cups, the two of cups as the overall, okay. Alrighty, let's see what's been going on then. Ten of pentacles. Hmm. The magician. The fool. Wow. We start off very strong. Okay, let's see what, oh, nine of cups, the hierophant. Mm, four of pentacles, all right. Judgment. Page of cups. Three of cups. Wow, Aquarius. This has already started off to be a very, very positive and strong, strong reading here. Okay, overall card, two of cups. We have the ten of pentacles, magician, and the fool from the recent energies around you. Um, Aquarius, you have really been creating so many positive things for you, for your surroundings, for your, you've done a lot of inner work here, Aquarius. There's been a lot of um, positive changes. The Ten of Pentacles, there's um, a, a a lot of success that you have created all for you, you know, by yourself. It's something within you that you wanted. You've been able to manifest it here with a magician. You've taken all the, the uh, relevant tools for you and you've be, been able to just create and visualize things and able to put it into um, a reality. And you are one that is not afraid to take risks. And you know that, um, you know, it's, it's kind of now or never sort of mentality that you've been having here with the fool. Um, and in terms of love, great, 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 like an outpouring prosperous love here we have. Um, and there's a very strong uh, sense of unionship here with the Ten of Pentacles especially. And um, I see there is um, an element of of um, excitement, like a big strong uh, feeling of excitement, of this, you know, leap of faith, both of you wanting to just really um, go for it together for the long haul. Um, and then the current, we have the Nine of Cups, the Hierophant, the Four of Pentacles, yes. So whatever you're doing, Aquarius, it is working. You are really uh, able to, um, you're just, you're a very strong Manifest it's almost like you're a master at manifesting to be honest here with the nine of cups you know you, once you've you've um set a goal you're determined to 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 finish it to actually you know to gain that to win it um in a in a healthy and constructive way so um there's a lot a lot of love coming in and here with the Hierophant you know things are getting serious things are getting very very serious here um, there is a a, um, a sign of deep commitment of wanting to go to the next level here with you this other person this connection and you um, are both more or less on the same wavelength here Aquarius, uh, you're, you're really going forward and also there's sort of like a higher, higher truth that uh, you, you may be seeking and I think that sort of thing allows you um, and pushes you to, to go even further with things that you put your mind to, you know, you're, you like to explore. But definitely, um, you know, this 
there's a relationship that's that's going on to the next level something really serious you know possible marriage and then here with the four of pentacles so um you're very protective of the people around you of yourself you want to protect your heart and you also like to protect um your loved ones as well and especially with this connection with this relationship it's something that you really want really want to sort of keep close to you um and keep guarded as well and here were the judgment page of cups and the three of cups in the possible outcome here so um I think decisions are, are going to be made, something very, very important, something very big, um, I think, in terms of this um, love. Um, and it's calling, and I'm saying actually a higher truth, and also this judgment is sort of like a, like a, a calling to you for, for something higher as well. Um, and in terms of love, it is kind of uh, laying out plans, the both of you, going on um, and seeing the future for the long term here. Um, and with the judgment, it's, 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 you know, kind of asking for you to be grounded, but, you know, um, also to just continue enjoying this this connection here as well page of cups three of cups um so it's definitely um this offer coming in that it seems quite it new there's a new chapter there's a new chapter coming in with this situation and then we have the three of cups so i do see celebrations coming in i do see i think you know with the uh, with the both of you in the future you you both could perhaps you have mutual friends in common that could be one thing or you know you kind of know the same people similar people around you but there's something of a new beginning a new start to your lives and that could be because once you get to that next level it is then a new beginning a new start to your life Aquarius um, and then in terms of work that is very very prosperous here I do see it's something whether you have been planning on starting something um, a new business or uh, a change in direction with what you do or, or that's that will be very very successful your decision you will make the right decision basically and it it's definitely definitely something very um, beneficial in many, many ways and for many areas of your life. And then here, you know, we do have the Two of Cups. So definitely um, some very, very strong union looking out to something um, that's a long-term commitment slash marriage. Okay, let's conclude this. We have the Seven of Pentacles. Okay. Five of Cups. And then we have the Ace of Wands. So I think you, with here with the Seven of Pentacles, you know the direction that everything is going. Um, and I think you're quite pleased and satisfied with, with its growth as well. Um, you're gathering lots of things together. You're gathering information as well. Um, here with the five of cups perhaps with this gathering of information because everything else around to be honest is continuing to flourish you have um, uh, you know planted yourself a very good healthy seed and has good roots and it's growing strong um, there's something around it that you're collecting some knowledge of some sort brings you to the five of cups perhaps you know you, you will find something out that um you may feel a little bit disappointed in, but however, something that, you know, the other cups that are standing is still a lot stronger. You're able to move on. There's something from your past you will be moving on from. Um, it's time for you that you, and you know, it's time to completely let go of whatever was in the past. Because here with the Ace of Wands, it's a new massive offer coming in. Um, and this offer here with the Ace of Wands leads you to, again, a, you know, a big new world in your life a new beginning, a new, like a huge stepping stone that you have here, Aquarius, um, 
very, very strong. And a, a true, true love, to be honest, that I see. They are um, heavily around you. You're, you. You are heavily on their mind. Um, and there is no doubt in terms of how they do feel about you, their love. Um, and it's just the um, the outlook on things after you, you know, uh, leave the past and onto the present and the future. I mean, things are, are shining bright, bright, bright. Let's look at the Oracle cards here. Let's look at the Moonology for Aquarius, please. Your hard work is paying off. Your hard work is paying off new moon and Capricorn, yes. Yes, yes. Your hard work is paying off. I mean, look at all of this. By the way, in terms of signs, you could be dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but also water. could be Scorpio, Pisces, um, a Cancer, possibly. Um, it's just oh, somewhere in their placement. It's quite... Um, heavily there but hard work is paying off you know here, here with your vision your manifestation and you're putting those things into action Aquarius and you're very good at that the answers you need are coming full moon in Gemini the answers you need are coming indeed they are I mean look at this indeed they are Ooh. what fell what fell which one confidence is your key to success New moon in Leo. Confidence is your key to success. And I think Aquarius, with this energy that you have in this period, it's a really good energy and I would not let go of that because, you know, you're very much, um, you know, here with the magician and the fool. You're so uh, good with being able to see things and make it happen. Uh, and, you know, once you add your confidence to that, it just sort of speeds up the process and you just, uh, you know, you, you, you stand tall, you stand strong. Um, and you certainly do here. This, these are just all really, truly amazing cards. Very powerful. Um, you know, love is coming in and so is a lot of success for you, Aquarius. This is incredible. I really hope that this, uh, resonated and I definitely look forward to the next one. Thank you so much.